My big brother Andy said, if anything ever happens to me, I want you to throw a party and I want there to be fireworks. Well, eventually we did have a party. But first, I had to clear his house full of stuff. So, this is called stuff, stuff, stuff. <laughs> stuff, stuff, stuff. Stuff, stuff, stuff. Stuff, stuff, stuff. But never enough. Blocking out the golden light where it used to be so bright. A dresser! Oh, what a gem! And Trambui and some speckled hair. <laughs> the clutter monster has to hoard, because one day he may not afford to spend his pennies on buying it new. And it may be worth a bob or two. Fancy your chances with laser discs. <laughs> and outside, some discarded bricks. <laughs> and a round shackle of the fallen down wall. Cameras? He has kept them all! <laughs> Stacks of every kind of dish and plate. Enough to feed an army on this whole estate. But it's hard to enjoy a bite to eat. With so much stuff you can't find a seat. <laughs> Boxes everywhere. There's no escape. And 20 rolls of gaffer tape. <laughs> Here and there, a battery. Together, could power a battery. Some things found. Some things won, some things passed from father to son. I guess I should say thanks to Andy. For all his stuff might come in handy. <laughs> but I mustn't lie, I must confess to not being grateful for this mess. How tempting to set it all alight. <laughs> And blow it up high with dynamite. <laughs> Surely he would smile. Surely he would smirk. If I commissioned a rocket or big firework. <laughs> and wouldn't he think it would be really ace to blast him and his stuff? Acts into space. <laughs> <laughs>